Today I will show you how you can get the best FPS on Call of Duty Warzone for low end PC on Windows 10. But before, subscribe to the channel, like the video, and follow me on Instagram. First you need to go here, type check, press on check for updates, here you can update your windows, just press on check for updates and follow the steps to be up to date. Now open the game. Go down here to the options, then go to graphics, press on display. On the display mode, select full screen. Display monitor, select your monitor. Display adapter, select your video card. Render resolution, just select 100. Dynamic resolution, select disabled. Dynamic resolution frame rate target, select 10. Aspect ratio, select 16 by 9. Vertical sync, select disabled. Custom frame rate limit, select unlimited. Brightness, select 40. Display Gamma, select 2.2 sRGB. NVIDIA Highlights, select Disabled. And NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency, select Enabled Plus Boost. Press Apply Settings. Then go up here to the Quality. On the Field of View, select 60. Camera Movement, select Least 50%. Streaming Quality, select Low. Texture Resolution, select Very Low. Texture Filter Anisotropic, select Low. Particle Quality, select Low. Bullet Impacts and Sprays, select Disabled. Tessellation, select Disabled. Dismemberment and Gore Effects, select Disabled. On Demand Texture Streaming, select Disabled. Filmic Strength, select 1. Film Grain, Select 0. Anti-aliasing, select off. Depth of field, select disabled. World motion blur, select disabled. Weapon motion blur, select disabled. Shadow map resolution, select low. Cache spot shadows, select disabled. Cache sun shadows, select disabled. Particle lighting, select low. Ambient Occlusion, select Disabled. And Screen Space Reflection, select Disabled. Press Apply Settings. Then go up here to the Interface. On the Subtitles, select Disabled. Color Blind Type, select Disabled. Tooltips, select Disabled. Horizontal Heads Up Display, select 100. Vertical Heads Up Display, select 100. Mini map shape, select round. Mini map rotation, select disabled. Show compass, select disabled. Kill feed duration, select 10 seconds. Scroll down to system. On the frames per seconds counter, select enabled. Server latency, select disabled. Packet loss, select disabled. GPU temperature, Select Disabled GPU Time Select Disabled CPU Time Select Disabled Show Mute Sound Widget Select Disabled Show Mute Voice Chat Widget Select Disabled System Clock Select Disabled Skip Introduction Movie Select Enabled And In Game Alert Icons Select Custom Press Apply Settings. Now you need to have the ultimate performance guide on your PC. So go here, type CMD, right click on Command Prompt, and press on Run as an Administrator. Then this page will pop up. Here you have to paste a command. Copy this command from my description. And just right click and paste it here, then press Enter. And now you have the ultimate performance guide. But to activate it, you need to close the page, then go here. Type Choose. Press on Choose a Power Plan. Then you have to press on this arrow. Scroll all the way down. Check Ultimate Performance. And now you have it activated. Go here. Type this PC. Right click on it. Press on Properties. Here you have to go to Advanced System Settings. This page will pop up. On the Advanced, under Performance, press on Settings. Here you have to check adjust for best performance. 
then press apply. OK. OK again. Close the page. Go here, type graphics, press on graphics settings. Make sure you have this on. Then press here on browse. Search where you have your Call of Duty folder. Double click on it. And this is the right file you need to find. This with 258 megabytes. First right click on it, press on properties. Here you have to go to compatibility. Check disable full screen optimization. Then go here to change high DPI settings. Check this box. Then press OK. Press apply. OK. Then select it. Press here on add. When you have this here, press on options. Here check high performance. Press on save. Go back here to settings home. Go to gaming. On the Xbox game bar, select this to off. Then on the game mode. Select this to on, for the optimization from graphics settings to work. Now right click on the screen, press on NVIDIA control panel. This page will pop up, go to adjust image settings with preview, check use the advanced 3D image settings, press apply, then go here to manage 3D settings. Here we have to change some settings, open GL rendering GPU, select your video card, power management mode, select prefer maximum performance. Texture filtering quality, select high performance. Threaded optimization, select on. And vertical sync, select off. Press on apply. Then go here to adjust desktop color settings. Scroll down to digital vibrance. Move this to 70%. Press apply. Close the page. And now enjoy the game. <laughs>